Hello, super nerd friends. This is me in the coat closet. How exciting is that? Because I told Haley that I would learn a song on the bagpipes and play it for you. You probably wouldn't appreciate that at all, and it would probably be really loud, and the neighbors wouldn't appreciate it either. But despite all those things, both Joanne and my mom are gone, and so I thought, what a wonderful time to learn how to play the bagpipes. And I thought that until Sam was in my room asleep, and I felt bad, and I'm being crowded out by the coats, which are expanding. And, um, Hannah's downstairs, and I have to stay downstairs with her. So I remembered the coat closet, and I forgot how little space there was in it, and so I thought, what a perfect place to play the bagpipes. And I did that for a little bit. Uh, and so now I can play five notes pretty well. There's some, there's some weird stuff that happens. Sometimes it goes too low and sometimes it squeaks really horribly. Um, so I won't play it for you. Um, but yeah. Uh, so yeah, here's, here's the coat closet. It's getting kind of warm in here with the laptop. Um, but, uh, yeah. I haven't done anything today, that's why I kind of wanted a change of atmosphere, maybe. Because um, I told you guys everything I was I was going to say, basically. Um, although, I'll say it officially now in a video, I'm sorry that I said you don't watch Doctor Who, and here for the second, this is the second time I've done this video, and I am still sorry. Well... No, I, I still meant to um, look up exactly what I said, but I think I said that you don't watch Doctor Who. You have watched it, past tense, different bits of it, but I say you don't watch it because you aren't up to date with it. And not everyone can get up to date uh, in a couple weeks, like uh, maybe I did. Uh, and not everyone is, <sighs> Coates, is as um, big a fan as I am. I accept that. But, Alexis, how long has it been since you last watched Doctor Who? And, and, uh, Haley, I know Chris Freckleson was your favorite Doctor. Um, and yes, I remember, we watched the first two seasons, and then one with Freema Adjaman, and, um, one with Matt Smith. Uh, anyway, I'm sorry for that, but Joanna stands by me. I, I told her how much you guys have watched, and, um, she... Stands by me that you don't want, uh, and I'm I'm sorry. You, I probably underestimated the role that Doctor Who plays in your lives. Maybe it's affected you more than I know. Um, but uh, I didn't mean that you don't know what Doctor Who is. Obviously, you do. Obviously, you care a little bit about it, and you haven't failed the coats. The coats. You haven't failed me because I did get you to watch a bit of it. I suppose. So, so thanks for that. Sorry, and Alexis, I'm glad that you were able to find your video. So, sorry also for interrupting that. Um, but I'm bad at making decisions, and I still haven't decided. And I told my mom that I was deciding which video game to get. Um, hopefully I can lean on this door and it won't pop up. Some of our doors pop open if you lean on them too hard. So I'm leaning. Uh, this might get exciting now. Um... I told my mom, because it's going to have to be shipped, and, you know, she'd find the mail, and... Becky, did you order a video game? So I told her I was deciding between three games, and, um... Because she knows I have $15 at Hastings. I'm not spending 15 of my hard-earned money. It's money that I have at Hastings, and I can't buy anything Doctor Who related with that, because Doctor Who stuff is expensive. Um, so she said, you know, we'll talk to Dad. Um, I haven't... <sighs> Yeah, when I get a computer game, when I get started on it, I tend to spend a lot of time on it, like Bastion or Nancy Drew. Um, but I don't play video games that often, I don't think my parents really realize that. I don't think they really realize what- I don't think I realize what I do with my time. I did finish a fan fiction just now. Uh, oh, um, books, book club. I'm all for reading Perks of Being a Wallflower, because Haley actually hasn't read it. Um, so yeah, if you don't mind, you know, going with my suggestion. Um, I mean, I don't want to, um, take away Haley's time to read one of her books. Um, but yeah, I think that would be good. Um, I kind of said before that I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave the coat closet now, because this isn't working. Um, it was fairly well lit in there, though. So that was, so do you see how much space there is in there? There is no space. It got warm. 
Um, um, I said in my last video, my screen just turned off. That was, that was weird. Um, that, uh, maybe we can just kind of make it casual and just, you know, read a book. Because there are books that, um, Haley's read, that, like World War Z. It'd be great if we could all talk about World War Z, and it'd, it'd just be great if we could, you know, have things to talk about. So maybe, you know, not have a specific structure to the books that we read, and like, oh, we're going to read this many chapters, and then we're all going to be here and stuff, but just, you know, kind of read it casually. I mean, that, that'd be hard, obviously, for, like, spoilers and stuff. Um, so, I don't know, just reading, it shouldn't, doesn't seem like it should be this difficult to, um, come up with. Anyway, anyway, totally, um, I, I, I am finishing the Diamond Age, though, and when I say that, I mean I, I intend to finish the Diamond Age, because I'm actually just finishing reading fan fiction. But I did finish that last night. So now I'm reading The Diamond Age. Um, and I was going to go up with, um, with my mom to Bellevue today, because she said, driving! And I was going to get up in the morning, too, but I didn't, because my mom said, driving, we can do driving today. Oh, look at the poppy. But um, that's not a motivation for me to get out of bed, because I'm terrified of driving. I really, really don't. I haven't driven in weeks. I know I just gonna have to do it, but I'm... I'm terrified of driving. So, hey Poppy. So, um, that's horrible lighting. My house is horribly lit. Um, so I didn't go up to Belfie with her. Uh, I don't know why I said that. Anyway, I signed up for another class at Belfie College. It's a human development class. It's called Learning Strategies for Student Success. So I'm going to take three classes, that's one of them, but it's only two credits. Uh, and it's only one weekend, um, but I think there's going to be like some writing I have to do for it. It's a pretty intense weekend though, it's like all day. Like 8 in the morning to 5 at night. Like big. Anyway, that'll be cool. Yeah. Um, I'm, I'm fourth now on the waitlist for statics, instead of seventh. I started out, but I'm not going to be taking statics. So I'm going to be doing handball choir, though. I hope. Uh, I think I can't think very well when I'm walking. See, that's the that is the extent of my disability to multitask. I can hardly even think and walk. <laughs> um, I guess that might be a good thing for me to learn. I don't know. Um, here I am, back here. This is where I started out. See, and everywhere I sit, there's horrible light. Anyway, um, 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 um. Alexis, you just sent me a video with Hank, so I was gonna watch that. Um, but I opened it in the middle of, in a, <laughs> I interrupted, you interrupted me in my video. That's why I stopped the last one, because you messaged me on Facebook, which, you know, wasn't urgent or anything. But then I went and checked it out, and, <laughs> and then Hank started talking to me. So I was like, ah! Uh, so. So anyway, back over here, um, yeah, video games, so I'm deciding between, um, Left 4 Dead, which I'm pretty sure you can play between platforms, because you can play it up with up to eight people, and I think you can play across Steam, too, because Steam has a thing where you can play, like, through Steam with friends, or you can play, like, online and connect with other people who don't have Steam, I'm pretty sure. That's how it should work, because you can play it with up to eight people, so you can't, you can't all have, you know, Xbox... I don't know, I think, I think it's across platforms and across Steam. So, um, if you guys both have that, then, yeah, I would totally shoot up some zombies, um, with you guys, that'd be fun. Um, or just, you know, play the game by myself. It is kind of, I mean, like one of the Harry Potter games, <laughs> the one that Haley was playing that was, she was so frustrated with, is also co-op. Uh, with, with the computer. And those can be kind of frustrating, relying on a computer to, you know, not get you killed. Um, but it would be cool with uh, actual people. That'd be fun. Um, so yeah, I'm deciding between Left 4 Dead, Assassin's Creed, and Bioshock. I don't know. I don't know. I can't, cannot decide. Um, yeah. I don't know, maybe just one of these days I'll feel really driven to buy one. But no rush, as Moriarty would say. Um, I loaned um, both my Sherlock seasons to our neighbor, and I, I feel their loss. Man. 
I know I wouldn't be watching them now, but I miss them. I miss them a lot. Uh, oh, there, there are three words. Three words for Sherlock Season 3. The three that I saw on Twitter were pipe, slippers, and bed. And I was like, well, I didn't, I didn't really think too much about that. I was just like, ah, three words for season three, what could they mean? And then Joanna, the same day, was like, yeah, three words for season three. And she's like, rat, um, something, and something. And I'm like, those aren't the three words I heard. But I, I got the three fake words. Mark Gatiss tweeted fake words and then tweeted the real words. And she found the real words and I found the fake words. So, there are three real words out there, but I forget what they are. Shows how devoted I am to Sherlock. Um, but I totally converted Emily into a Sherlock. You maybe have seen her, her, her post on Facebook, and we talked for an age about Sherlock. Like, why is she so beautiful? <laughs> uh, yeah. Anyway, I've been rambling. Um, this was supposed to be really short because I didn't have anything to say, but that's just the way things go. Um, I'm going to go try to finish Diamond Age now and maybe apply to some jobs. No, nope, right now I'm going to go play some more bagpipes in the closet. Okay. Okay, bye guys!